Hey Sharers, what's going on? Welcome back to my channel. As you guys know, in Steven's last vlog, we were so close to capturing this huge, huge monster, which ran from that tree over there. <laughs> and right now, it's in the water. We saw it dive into the water. So Steven's over there with a net trying to capture it. So since we know that the monster is currently in the pond because we just saw it dive into the pond, we're going to get all these spy gadgets and fishing equipment to come down here and capture this monster. And sure, it's really important that we capture this monster now because we're trying to set up the world's biggest inflatable obstacle course in the pond and have some summer fun. Yeah, Grace, we gotta go up and grab some bait and stuff. Look what I found, this is kinda weird. Oh, what did you find? I don't know, it's like twiny stuff. Wait, that looks like maybe it's like hair? Well, the monster, so it shares a monster dove into the pond right here. Yeah, like so right here. So I'm wondering here. if this was part of the monster's skin, because look at this, like scales or something? You see scales? Well, right on the ledge here, look, there's more of this stuff. And it's nowhere else in the pond, it's right in this exact spot. So I'm wondering if this is part of the monster's scales. Yeah, I, I don't no know. Idea. I have no idea. All I know though is that this net is not gonna work. We gotta go grab some bigger equipment. Yeah, we gotta get some major equipment. So we got a lot of stuff up at the house. Chris, let's go grab it. Let's get this monster out. Yeah, come on, Shares, let's go. Let's go. Okay, let's get all the supplies set up. Look what we have, Shares. We have these crazy jumpsuits that you put on when you're searching for monsters in the pond. And that way you don't get wet. You can go like up to your hips on them. Yeah, look, this whole thing is waterproof. And it goes all the way up here, so I could basically walk underwater. And the pond is decently enough shallow on the sides. It's like four or five feet on the sides. So we could stand on the sides in the water, look for the monster. Yeah, this will be really helpful. So we have this one and that. And then we upgraded our net from yesterday. This thing is definitely big enough. Yeah. should definitely capture the monster. Look, the monster is like my height, and look. That'll work. This then, will definitely whoa, work. Whoa, whoa, whoa. See, that'll work. Oh, yeah. That's strong, too. And I can't get out. And then to get out, just go like that. Perfect. And then next. We have fishing toolkits that have bait and all sorts of fishing supplies inside. Oh yeah, and for the bait, we're gonna use bread. I don't know if you've ever done this trick, Shares, but there's a lot of fish that if you take pieces of bread and you throw it into the water, the fish will actually come nibble. So we're thinking that bread is gonna be the perfect bait. So open up one of the tackle boxes, Grace. Okay, tackle box, open up, just we'll like stick that. stick it in here. Perfect, just like that. So we got some okay. food in there. Put that in there. And then to go along with that, we have these giant fishing rods. And look at the hook that we put on. We made our own hook. This is what I'm talking about. Yeah, because as you guys saw in Steven's video, that monster is big, so we needed to upgrade to a big hook. This will be perfect. If you did a regular fishing hook, I don't think it would work, but. No, yeah. It'll be perfect. It won't hurt the monster either. Right. It'll just be enough to capture him. We can reel it in. And put and him then, in a safe spot. Yeah, we can put him in the net to take him out of the pond, or we can also use this thing. And for this net, check this out, Sharers. This one's awesome. If you're on a boat, you swing it around, and then you throw it really far out, and it lands on the ground, and the monster will walk right in. Yeah, so if any monster walked on top, as soon as it's underneath, you we'll, just... We'll feel movement and yank it up. Woo! And carry it up to the top. Stuck in the net, lifts it to the top. That works. Yeah, that works. And then just in case, we also have this crab trap right here. This is a very similar technique. As soon as the monster walks in, you could trap one of its feet by going like this and hiya, capturing it just like that. Yeah, so we have all sorts of gadgets right now, a whole variety. I think we can't miss this monster. I think we'll capture it this time. Yeah, let's bring it all down to the pond and let's put them to use. Yeah, let's do it. Come on, let's go. Okay, Shares, we have all the supplies down at the pond and the monster's currently in the water. But as you guys know, the first step of capturing the monster is to surveillance the area. So let's put our gear on, Grace. Okay. Um, let's see, which one do you want? I'll take brown. That looks a little smaller. Okay. I'll put these ones on. Oh yeah, this looks really cool, Steve. All right, let's go surveillance the area, Grace. Okay, I gotta tighten it because we're getting serious. Okay, I'm gonna grab a net. Here, can you open up the food? Okay. Okay. How big of a piece do you want, Steve? Uh oh, we got a little bit of an issue. Oh. Oh boy. Yeah. Yeah. A little tangled. Hang on yeah. one second. Got to untangle this. Shares, have you ever fished before? Comment down below, cause it's a lot harder than it looks. This fishing line gets everywhere. Yeah, they get tangled a lot too. What am I supposed to do? Okay, we gotta we gotta bait the hook right here. Okay piece of bread right on it, just like that. That looks pretty good. Okay, you'll have that and I'll carry the net. Okay. 
We'll try this as step one. Baiting the monster in with bread and a fishing line. You ready, Grace? Get that net ready. Okay. Let's go, uh, we'll go this way a little bit. Just around the pond, I guess. Yeah. We'll cast it in right where he was yesterday. Where did he jump in, right around this area? I think it was like right here. Okay, you ready? Yeah. I'm gonna cast this thing out, here we go. Okay, stand back, I'm a little nervous. Three, two, one, and cast. Here we go. Woo! All right, there's a piece of bread, it's floating out there. Take a look. Okay. Now we just wanna slowly reel it in. Hopefully it'll actually work. The pond actually looks pretty clear, like there's not even fish around this piece of bread. Yeah, it's so weird. There's nothing, no movement either. Hang on, let me reset. Uh-oh. Uh oh Here, Here I got grab it. That. Let's reset. We might need a new piece of bread. Oh, yeah. Oh. We need another piece of dry bread. One more piece of bread coming right up. I got the bag of bread, Steven. Here you go. All Let's right. get a good piece this time. Just like this, and out the other side. Oh, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. All right, okay. <laughs> step back, here we go. Three, two, two one, one, go. Here it goes. Woo! Whoa, whoa. What happened? No, the bread got oh, too no. wet, it broke apart. Oh, All right, no. we gotta yeah, move the plan good. B, but it looks like we gotta get over to the shade. Yeah, I definitely see movement over there. We need to hurry. Here, don't go too fast. We don't wanna scare the monster away. Oh, yeah. If we go closer to the shade, this might work better, Grace. Yeah, Come on. get it, get us some sort of spy gadget, Steven. I need, uh, oh, you got the net. Let me grab this net just in case. Looks good. Yeah, it looks good. Okay. This is a bottom feeder net, so if we do this one right, I can drag it across the bottom of the pond. Something like this looks good. Yeah. We'll here, bring come this on, through. we need to hurry. All right, here, Grace, you go over there. I'll get this net set up. Okay. All right, go, 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 go. Okay, sure. We need to hurry, but also move slow and quiet so we don't scare it away. But there's definitely movement happening over there in the shade. I see it. I see it. I'm going in, Shares. I'm going deep. I hope this thing is waterproof. Woo! Oh dear. It might be too deep. Hang on. Grace, it might be too deep. I don't know if I can go all the uh -oh. way. Yeah, it's really deep here. I can't touch. All right, but I'm just gonna skither across this way, just like this, until I can touch. Oh, there's something on the ground. Oh, oh, I feel something. Oh, is it moving? Yeah, I don't know what it is. Oh, it's a rock, it's a rock. We're good, it's a rock. It's a rock, I'm good, I'm touching right now. Okay. Oh, and it's deep again. This might be too deep for these hip waders. Oh dear. Hold on, I thought it was shallower here. I think it might be like five feet or something. It's very deep, I can't touch. These hip waders aren't gonna work, Grace. Really? Yeah, I don't think How I can. How deep is it? It's deep, look at that. Yeah, like, it is deep. I'm about to like start letting water in and these hip waders, I can't touch. Oh no, Grace, these aren't gonna work. <laughs> oh no. No, this is the biggest fail ever. Oh no, how are we supposed to get it? I don't know, Grace, you know what? I'll hop on the boat with the net towing behind me. You go this way, okay? Okay. I'll, I'll grab this paddle boat. Okay. Get ready, tie this one to the back of the boat. Okay. I'll flip the boat over, okay? Okay, let's, yeah, this will work if we put this on the back of the boat and drag it, okay? You gotta flip it that way. You ready? Yep. Three, two, one, lift. Whoa. Oh. And push. Okay. And go. Whoa. Okay. Okay, you wish take off luck. and I'll meet you on the other side. Okay, wish me luck, Shares, I'm off. Grace, good luck on your mission. Okay, you too, Steve. Okay. Going for it. Yeah, I think if you just drag it along, it'll slowly have to go inside it. We're probably right on top of where we need to be. Okay. Let Keep me put this out. in the water. I'll look up here, Grace. Keep okay. an eye out. We're probably right on top. This is the only shady spot in the pond right now, so the monster's gotta be around here. Okay, I'm putting this net in the water. It is very deep here. Yeah, he, the monster's not here, Grace. It must not have moved. Here? It must have moved. Wh where could it have gone? I don't know. To like another Wait, wait, look, 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 there it is, there it is, there it is. Whoa, 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 wait, whoa, whoa. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Hurry, 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 hurry. Get up, get up, hurry. Whoa, it's going underwater, it's going underwater. It's going underwater. Keep your eye on it, let's go, 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 Grace, go, go, go. There it is, there it is, go, 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 where is it? Where is it? It's not under the boat. It's, it's gotta in the be in the shade. shade it's gotta be in the there. shade. It's like shady. There's only two shady spots in the whole pond right now. Right there, which is swam from, and to the shady spot. Yeah, it must just be going back and forth. All right, careful, look. There's a lot of stuff in the water right here. Yeah. Murky stuff. Well, I guess it's just around here, Grace. Okay, my net is in. It can only be right in this area. There's definitely something right there. There's something there. 
You know what, Grace? It's too sunny out right now. I think we're gonna have to do something like this at 3 a.m. when the pond, when the whole pond is shady or something like that. Yeah, definitely the monster does not like the sun. It likes the shade. And shares, you know what? We got some heavy equipment. I think we can use, Grace. We do. We can use the. <gasps> yes. Yes, shares. Come on over to my channel. I got just the right equipment to use to get this pond monster out. Yeah, we're going to solve this, Steven. Click the card right here, and when the video is live, we're going to get this pond monster captured. Let's get it out of here. Oh yeah.